What's up YouTube? It's your boy C to the Nano 4 and I'm here for a special occasion as well as touch on a few things I wanted to talk about. Uh, recently I hit 1,000 subscribers so I have to thank all you new guys for subscribing. Uh, hopefully you watch uh, the videos which is why you subscribe and uh, it's been a while since I've done the stop motion but I got some stuff in the works so hopefully it will live up to expectations to be just as good as stuff I've already done and hopefully you guys enjoy that. Uh, also, it's my, uh, well, it was a while back, but I hit two years here on YouTube, in which uh, I didn't think I would make it past episode two, and uh, episode one was uh, poorly organized when I did it, and evidently you guys enjoy it because it's over 100,000 views, so obviously somebody's enjoying it since it's been watched, has so many views. I guess. <laughs> I don't know. It's definitely not one of my favorites. But that's just me because I'm so hard on myself about my own work. Um, episode 7. Now, I know it's been a while since I've done episode 6. And a lot of you guys have been asking about the deal with episode 7. So, I want to be honest. I procrastinated. And when I made plans to work on the episode, stuff would come up. Stuff would constantly get in the way. And hopefully, I finally got a lot of those distractions out of the way, and I'll be able to focus on episode seven pretty soon. And uh, I'm going, to, and about 50% of it is 100% complete and could be uploaded today. Problem with it is that it would be a huge cliffhanger because the film scenes that are, that are parts that are filmed and parts that still need to be filmed. So of course, that couldn't, it wouldn't make sense. Uh, also, depending on the timing, there may be an extra scene at the end. If not, that be that scene will be saved to be the beginning of episode eight. Um, also, I'm having troubles with it, episode seven soundtrack because of uh, all the copyright stuff they got going on on YouTube now. Uh, episode six audio was removed because of a song used in the ending credits, and I had to upload a second version. And now episode three has an ad on it because of the Kanye West song I used in the ending credits. So this copyright stuff is crazy man, they're taking people's videos down. So it's a minor issue. So I'll probably I'll, I'll deal with that once the episode is complete. It's put adding music in isn't difficult at all. Uh, also uh, I've been considering but I wanted to ask your guys opinion about Takahashi versus Nakamura. Now, if you've watched the video, it was extremely random. It probably doesn't make sense to you, but it was a video I did for a group presentation, of which my part of the presentation was um, work conditions in Asia, in which Takahashi versus, versus Nakamura, during the, during the presentation, I claimed it was secret video footage from an office building in Japan that was top secret. It was a, it was a huge catastrophe, catastrophe, and it was top secret. Nobody wanted to view it. And I found it, and I brought it to class for them to see it. And that's the point of the video. But watching it now, it didn't take, I'm going to be honest, it only took me two days to make that video. And I was thinking that, it, of course, it, it wouldn't hinder Greatest of All Primes production because Takahashi versus Nakamura would probably be two to five minute episodes. And of course, if I turn it into a series, then that would mean voice actors because I wouldn't do, that's one thing I don't want to do is have to voice 30 different characters. Takahashi versus Nakamura would be a whole new cast, probably a bunch of figures that I don't use for Greatest of All Prime just to give those guys some use. So, of course, that's where you guys would come into play. So, one, I want to ask you a question. If you think it would be a good idea to turn Takahashi vs. Nakamura into a sitcom-type series with two to five-minute episodes, and two, second question would be, would you guys voice audition? Because, of course, if you don't get a part for Takahashi vs. Nakamura, I could... Continue. To, I can contact you later for a part in Greatest of All Prime. 
So I guess it would be a win-win situation. I wouldn't have to do a voice audition video for Great Greatest Full Out Prime because people would have voice auditioned for Takahashi versus Nakamura. <clears throat> also, I want to do some, uh, once episode 7 is complete, I want to do some versus battles, which I've only done two so far. But I have a lot of animated and classic figures, new Revenge of the Fallen figures are out. So I wanted to go back and use a lot of those older figures that I've collected during this time period, this little vacation I've been on from stop motion. So uh, that's pretty much it, man. Versus battles, I want to try to do that. Um, I guess if you guys think it would be, whether you think it's a good idea or not to continue Takahashi versus Nakamura, leave a comment and let me know what you think. Uh, whichever side of the spectrum you're on, let me know what you think. That way I can uh, get a take on... I mean, because you guys watch my videos. There wouldn't be no point in continuing it if no one's interested. So if you're interested, if there's enough interest, I'll continue it. And which it, it would only take a few days to finish an episode. Um, so uh, you guys just let me know what you think. Uh, that's pretty much it. So I want to thank all the new subscribers. All the guys that have been sending me all the friend invites and leaving comments. All the messages, man. I appreciate it. You know what I'm saying? You guys are just incredible. Because I'm up to about 475,000 total views. And that is just a crazy number to be about 20,000 views away from half a million total. That's crazy. So I have to thank you guys. I really appreciate it. And uh, it's been two years here on YouTube. I owe you guys a lot. You guys brought me a long way, and uh, you guys been behind me. Some of you guys been there from the very beginning. Some of you haven't, and that's cool because, you know what I'm saying, you jump right, in, jump right on the bandwagon, and you've been there. You've been leaving the comments, all the ratings. I really appreciate it, man. So uh, I know there's not many people watch vlogs. So um, for those of you who stuck around, here's a little preview for Episode 7. Let you guys know that I've actually been doing work. So you guys take it easy, man. Let me know what you think. Uh, give me your opinion on Takahashi versus Nakamura. You guys take it easy, man. Hey, Optimus. How you doing? You look great, by the way. New tires? Good thing you brought that traitor with you. Saves us the trouble of hunting her down. Hold up. Who we calling a traitor? Chill out, Hot Rod. The rest of you are with me. Switch it all the way, Optimus. So, that was you outside the base. Yeah. I've always been just a little too quick for you, Prowl. Yeah, quick enough to get blasted right into the repair bay. Oh, that's cold. Leave this one to me. Destroy the others. So, you must be the leader then. Let's see what you got. The you Decepticons only want to abuse its life-giving power to satisfy your sick and twisted lust for death and destruction. Oh man, these Autobots talk way too much. Dude, let's just scrap and get it over with. I like your style, Swindle. You're in over your head, deceptive jerk. Aw oh, man, no fair. Dude, you have a freaking sword. Optimus Prime, you and all Autobots will pay for the destruction. Commence Operation Devastation. Let's see if that shield can hold this. Allow us to show you a true cannon. Ah.